Okay, so the Yukon corn, a 55 day corn. This is the results of it. <clears throat> so that's not very big. It's about the length from the tip of my middle finger to the end of my palm. And it's full of juice though. So hopefully it'll taste really, really good. Hey, this is Wednesday's harvest. Got a mess of green beans, and a mess of strawberries, two Kripnik squash, two zucchini, and a bucket full of cucumbers. So I am definitely making pickles tomorrow. Okay, this is Thursday, and this is today's harvest from the garden. Got a whole lot of kale. This is probably about four bunches of kale if you were to get it from the store. And then, oops, about two bunches of chard. And then I thin my carrots. And this is the thinnings plus these little bitties, which I'm dehydrating. And then um, I did some bee balm. More bee balm and bee balm petals. Some calendula petals. Yarrow. And then these last three trays are yarrow leaves. So I have a full dehydrator except for one tray. And that is today's harvest. This is Saturday, and this is today's harvest. I got a ton of cucumbers, a handful of raspberries, a handful of strawberries, a kohlrabi, my first cabbage, and it's huge. Yeah. A couple more of the crookneck squash and four zucchini. And then in here, I've got bread and butter pickles uh, chilling. And that was about as much uh, cucumbers as that is there. So it's going to be a long week of canning, I think. And it's like 90 degrees, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, this is today's harvest. I have 20 cucumbers, my first jalapeno, I think it's right, it was green and shiny and the other ones are all dull, uh, I'll find out later I guess, a uh, small handful of strawberries, um, a couple of dandelion greens with the roots, uh, some green beans. I thinned some carrots, there's two um, zucchini and half dozen radishes. And um, I've been making lots of pickles. I think I've done a total of 18 pints worth. So, and this is probably another well, this plus what I have in the fridge is at least another 12 pints or 6 quarts. And that's the harvest for the week.